Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I have thought of showing you all of my favorite red lipsticks at the moment, one after one. Just imagine my life without wearing red lipsticks. So if you are in the same genre, then please keep on watching and let me know your uh, favorite red lipsticks in the comment section below. Okay. So without further ado, let's jump into it. There is nothing on my lips right now. So the first shade I'm going to show you is the this one by Maybelline Superstay Ink Crayon. Okay, let me just quickly uh, put it on my lips. So how beautiful this color looks uh, on the lips, right? Because it has that um, undertone, that blue undertone that instantly, you know, brightens the entire face. Even if you do not have makeup on, I think this color will make you look absolutely amazing. I mean, this is the only shade that you could need uh, in those days, you know, when you don't feel like putting on makeup. I love, it. I love it and the formula is also amazing that's another thing I generally do not talk about formula but this one is matte and it might look a little glossy or creamy initially but later on it just becomes absolutely non-transferable matte so that's another plus point and I love everything that's made by baby so let's move on to the next shoe Shade right now is a very non conventional one because this is by Zara Beauty and I just love the shade. Uh, I know people do not like to buy from Zara or all these non conventional stores that also you know manufacture food products. This one is amazing. I'll show you. In Okay, so the name of the shade is Countess. Okay, Countess. And this is amazing. Formula wise, color wise, um, longevity wise, this one is amazing as well. Because, like the Maybelline one, I know it's quite similar because that's what attracts me the most this kind of a blue undertone red, uh, which is very suitable for. Uh, women like me like uh, whose skin tone varies from medium to dark so these kind of shades look amazing on us so yeah so the uh, shade name is Countess like I mentioned so if you really want to get it, get it. I love this let's move on to the next one hi so as you can probably tell uh, looking at my lips it's already stained so I want to just tell you about the Zara one that I previously mentioned so this one stains your lips and of course stays on your lips for the longest time unimaginable because I did not expect this kind of a quality from a brand like Zara who do not really manufacture lip products okay now let's move on to the third shade which is uh, Russian Red by MAC I have the mini one and um, yeah I'm going to swatch it for you I know most of you already have this one but I love it every time more than Ruby Woo is not very cool tone and Un very unlike the, love, the previous two shades I showed you whereas Ruby Woo we all know that's a uh, blue toned one a cool tone one whichever way you want to call it so that's how uh, this Russian red and ruby blue, these two are you know differentiated formula wise this one is very creamy unlike ruby blue, because ruby blue is so matte that it doesn't really like to glide on the lips and you need to put a lot of effort for 
that to glide on so i because of that i always prefer using a red like this one this is russian red and i love the color the formula especially more than the color the formula is something that i've always been gravitated for this lipstick okay so yeah that's how it looks like okay let's i have two more lipsticks to show let's quickly move on to that Okay, so I have removed um, Russian red and my lips are already burning because of all the sweat swatches that I've been doing. Um, so the second shade, uh, I'm sorry, the second last shade that I have is called Feel So Grand. Like the name suggests, it's a very beautiful uh, color with lots of grandeur in it. But unfortunately, it fell down from my hand and it just got shattered. So, I'm going to use a lip brush for the application and I'm going to swatch it. So. MAC feel so grand. One to the last. Okay, last but not the least. I have got another favorite of mine and this one is called Dance With Me which is a little like a maroonish red, a very dark toned red, a plum undertone you can see. Okay, I'm just going to show you that this is very very close to my heart because I have used this on some of my very important and very special occasions. Okay, so I'm going to just show you this one. Ta-da! So what do you think about this? I love it. Just so yeah, this is how exactly the color dance with me looks like and I just love it. This is, you can say that this is my most favorite red. I so these were the swatches of all the red lipsticks uh, that I adore at the moment. I want to listen from you people also like what are your favorite reds and whether you like or into nudes also. Please do let me know so that I can also make another video on my favorite nudes because we all love to wear nudes on certain days, right? When we are doing some smoky eyes or something like that. So I am really eager to learn it from you. Please let me know in the comment section below. I'll be waiting for your comments, okay? So for the next video, uh, keep on watching. So till then, bye.